Hey everyone, I'm Kate from Nanogirl. I'm a marine biologist and one of my favorite things to do in summer is to collect loads of cool shells and rocks from the beaches. I've got an awesome experiment where you can see what minerals your rock is made from and you might even get to see a rock fizz. So first of all, I have a rock. I collected it from Lake Wakatipu in Queenstown and I have a coin. You can use anything that's hard enough to scratch the surface of your rock because what we're going to do is we're just going to make a little scratch right in the middle. Okay, once we've got a scratch we're going to need a way of looking really closely at what's going on on the surface of this rock. So if you've got a magnifying glass you can use that. I'm going to use my NanoGirl clip-on microscope. It's just going to go over my phone like this. And now what I'm going to do, and this is the fun part, I'm going to take a little bit of vinegar and just dab it right into that scratch that I made earlier. We're going to get really close to this rock and take a little look at what's going on. And oh, I can see it fizzing. It looks like lots of little bubbles on the surface of my rock all rising to the surface. Now, that tells me that this rock has the mineral calcium carbonate in it. And calcium carbonate is also what shells are made of, like this cockle shell that I have from the beach. So if I do the same thing again, take my coin and make a scratch on the surface of the cockle shell, let's see what we find out. Okay, I'm going to put a little bit of vinegar on the surface of the shell and let's take a look. Yes, I can see it fizzing again. Awesome. So. This shell is made of calcium carbonate, which is also in this rock. And that tells me that this rock has got tiny bits of shell in it. And that means that this rock probably came from under the sea. You can be a rock detective and investigate where the rocks in the beaches near you came from. All you need is a coin and a bit of vinegar. Have a rocking great summer, everyone.